Hello guys, I am back. I am still doing what I'm supposed to do. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. Depending on your location at this time of the day, we are still talking about what is trending, what is going on in Nigerian politics. All right, um, it's no news that yesterday, um, Monday, was uh, PDP Anatiko Abubakar's um, uh, campaign kickoff that happened in Akwa Ibom State in Uyo. Okay, we already know the news, the details of the whole story. So, after the whole scenario, after the whole news, after the whole jubilation, PDP supporters came out with some, you know, videos that there was crowd in the stadium welcoming Atiko Abubakar. Well, it has been exposed. Yes. Now, let me tell you the truth. It is not only a Kwaibu. The campaign was not only for a Kwaibu. It was both for the South, South and the South East. Okay. So these are secondary school students or should I call them primary school? No, they are bigger than primary school. But let me just call them secondary school students because they are not even up to... Um, university standard and remember mind you also is on strike so there could have been nowhere these people would be mobilized now that also is on strike so we are not saying they are university students but actually this is the truth these are children that filled up entire stadium where these people claim that um uh, people welcome PDP with good arms and so on. They were brought in from different states, that is, both from the South South. I know some people that came from the South South, okay, travel all the way from uh, the South South, that is the southern part of uh, the country. Yeah, quite is still South South, but I know uh, some people who travel, all these um, support group and whatsoever. So that was it. And many of those support groups, they are obedient. I know plenty of them. Now, this is the truth. The truth has come out. All this noise coming out, crowd, maybe giving you some drone view uh, that the stadium was filled up and so on. There were secondary school students mobilized to go and um, filled up the entire stadium, not even minding um, this uh, Ebola Sorry, coronavirus um, pandemic period, okay? And NCDC has won against most of these things. And nobody was with no smacks. They were, don't be surprised, um, you know, this will may come up with the Ebola outbreak story or whatsoever. That is by the way. So this is the truth. The truth is out. Show them this picture. Why did they mobilize secondary school children? The children, they would have allowed to help their parents at home, sweep and cook for their parents. They had to mobilize them, put them in a bus, took them to um, a quiet boom stadium field for them to make noise there, that they had crowd. What kind of crowd? I mean, I really do not understand. All right, guys, I quickly want to update you on this. This is what happened in a quiet boom state. So if anybody says, ah, oh, PDP, this and that, show them this uh, picture. They should explain what are secondary school children doing in the field. Most of them don't even have um, PVC. All right, I quickly want to update you. Let me know what you think. See you guys.